Well, for those that have been watching my videos over the past while, you may have heard of this brand Lexin that I have recently started actually using a fair bit for riding. And I know it, this is not normally the time of year that I do a lot of motorcycle reviews because, well, it's middle of winter, not really the time. But my friends over at Lexin decided to release a new set of comps. So this isn't a completely new set. They've taken one of their primary communication devices, the FT4 by Lexan, and made a pro version. We have it right here, and we're gonna take a look at it just to see what's in the box. Now, sadly, it's middle of winter, so my bike's put away, all that's gone, just to show you guys what's in the box, and we're gonna go look at the website so that you can see if this pro version has some features in it that would warrant you making this purchase instead of just the plain FT4s. And that's coming up. Okay, so here's here's Lexan's website. Here's Lexan's website, Lexan. They have a few things that are coming up. I don't know if you just saw that there. They have a wireless motorcycle charger which fits on like a ram mount. I'm hoping to get my hands on one of those. Should be cool. Really what you and I are looking at is right here. Meet the all new FT4 Pro. Pro, everything with Pro in it means it's better. So what does the Pro actually mean? Here's the first thing. First off, I'm gonna put a link up here if you guys are interested in going to see the videos I did on the FT4 series because I actually was very fond of those they ended up being the comms that I pretty much use all the time now with the FT4s. The FT4 Pros, what is it? This is the dual pack. You can get them in a single or a dual, but what's what's the biggest? So it says here, we've taken our success with the FT4 and made it better. Why would you not make it better? Why would you give it a pro name and make it worse? You wouldn't. Pro, better, pro, pro. Have you ever needed, this is kind of cool. Have you ever needed to address a mechanical issue. So one of the things that they have now is on the comms, on the front of the comms, they have a flashlight. And I actually think this is kind of an ingenious concept and idea to be able to put some light on your helmet so that if something is wrong in the dark, you can literally see what's going on. Now it's probably not gonna be a huge light. It's probably gonna be something similar to what you have on a smartphone. But the thing is, is it's hands-free. It's attached to your helmet. That's, that's very cool. So a hands-free headlamp, super good idea. Next one and probably one of the biggest ones for those of us that are just using communication devices. It doesn't matter if we're using it to communicate with another rider or communicate on the phone with somebody else or to listen to GPS navigation or to listen to music or whatever it is that you and I are using these comms for is sound quality. Now I did find that the Lexans in general, both of the ones I did before, so I did the FT4s and I did the B4FMs, I believe they're called. So with both of those, I thought the audio was good. That's about as far as I was going. It was good. But that's kind of calm helmet audio. You're never gonna get great out of it. It's just, it's hard to get the pads in the right spot and some helmets, the speakers are recessed too much and you can't get them. There's just all kinds of issues. So if you're expecting any kind of like headphone sound quality that you'd get from like earbuds or something like that, it's just never happened. These ones here both say with our new Lexan Pulse sound system, the Pro model outperforms and exceeds both volume and sound quality expectations. So I'm excited to try that. I'm excited to try that. We may try that actually before spring comes because I want you guys, I can just put the helmet on. I can put a helmet. Maybe I'll even do that in this video, depending on how long this goes. So maybe at the end of this video, I'll just put a helmet on and we'll put the speakers in and we'll see how it sounds, right? That's an option. We, can make, we might do that. Other thing, of course, this device features four rider long range intercom with incredible premium sound. Yes, kit includes all the accessories needed. This fits on an open face, modular, full face helmets using the FTR Pro riders can make calls through their mobile phones, listen to stereo music, voice instructions from GPS, listen to FM radio, and much more. So all kinds of coolness, all kinds of stuff that you would like in here. Because I really like the things Lexans do. I like the brand Lexan. I like that they are a little more budget friendly, which is excellent. Because if you look at these, for instance, this one here, availability, and this is, I think this is just a single, 169, that's decent. 
you know that's not that's not going to break the bank if you're looking at just one and if you go to a dual set i don't know this is a single i'm not sure what their prices is for the dual dual 2.99 so if you're looking at two 300 bucks us that's that's not crazy bad and really comparing it to the original ft4s 149 versus 169 it's like 20 dollars 20 dollar difference to get the cool flashlight and to get better audio. For me, it's a no brainer. I think I would go with that. All right, anyways, I'm rambling. Let's look at this. This is the box right here. Lexan FT4 Pro, Bluetooth intercom. I got the dual pack, which is awesome. Thank you, Lexan. Lexan sent me these, so that's much appreciated. Four rider conference, noise, what? Noise canceling, hmm. Water resistant and trim light design. Very cool. Spinning around, we have, of course, all about it. One of the like things I really like is the jog wheel on them because even with even fairly thick gloves, I have no problems moving that jog wheel around and hitting the buttons. Everything's nice and big. Nice little instructions here about how it sets up. Mounting bracket, B button, what the A button does. Headlamp port, that's so cool. And a type C, this is new. Type C quick charging port, very cool. Uh, over here, be seen, be safe, be connected. I'm a little weird about that noise canceling. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of, what does that mean? I don't know. Uh, Siri and S voice compatible, universal Bluetooth compatibility, 15 hour battery life, so that's really good. 1.2 mile intercom range. So I tested the original FT4s, I had no problems, and I don't know about miles, but I had no problems getting at least a kilometer apart, without question. Me and my wife, no issues at all. Clear as if she was right beside me, so that was excellent. Uh, interchangeable microphones, utility lamp with SOS strobe, and as it says, type C quick charge. Super cool, I love that they've gone to the type C. That's excellent, because a lot of us, that's the cable we're going to now. So because of that, I don't wanna to have to carry nine different cables. Bunch of USB cables, we're good to go. Let's crack this open. I'm gonna put this right here. This comes with all of them, just so you guys see this. Please kindly read, fully insert the jack. And you know what, I talk about this in all my videos, this, you gotta make sure that's really in there. Make sure it really just clicks in there. For one, you'll see the little red. Make sure there's no space in between where the headphone goes in, because it's not connected. I've had it in there and realized it doesn't sound as good as normal. And then pushed on it and you hear this little click and you're like, oh, yeah, that, that was me, all me. It's a big manual, but it really is split into six languages. So it's not really that big, because that's English. Really, page one, page two, rocking and rolling, right? Here's whatever language that is, page one, page two. There's French, page one, page two. Nice big manual, which awesome. Fully color, fantastic. Nice and simple. You should have no problems hooking this up and getting it ready. Here they are. <whistles> look at that, FT4 Pros. Again, they look very similar. Do I have my FT4s around here? Yep. Here are the FT4s. So if you put those right up beside each other, I'm just gonna take one of these out. You know, they look identical to each other. No differences at all. If you look at the front, bit of difference here, just in the spacing of where the physical buttons are. This again is the FT4 on this side, FT4 Pro. And you'll see here, this is a micro USB. And this would be your headphone jack, where on the FT4 Pros, we have headphone jack and we have type C. So I like the type C. And there it is, check that out. You see that up top? There's that light, right? No light on this one. So super cool. The other thing that you can kind of see too is this light here, this like little LED light, this would glow different colors, so you're like red or blue or purple or whatever. It looks like the light is a little different here. And of course, it doesn't go down as far. This one wraps all the way down around the front, whereas this one goes just halfway down because that flashlight is kind of in the way. Super nice. What is that? I guess they both have them. Never mind. Nothing. Oh, that's the clamp where it mounts. Never mind. That's cool. So that's the old FT4s. So if you have a pair, You'll know what these are like. And as far as I know, if you really need to, that clamp that came with these and everything that came with this would still work on here, so. All right, so we're gonna move these down just again so you can kind of continue to see what's in this box. I like this little, it's like a little velvet little thing. It's all about presentation. It's all about presentation. So we have our big user guide. Awesome, look at the size of this guide. So good, pairing, color, fully insert, installing the speakers, installing the brackets, package contents. Well done, boys. I have to say, you know, 
and ladies, I don't know who's doing this, boys and ladies, men and women, whoever, whatever, you're all good. Phone calls, FM radio, this is a good size manual, right? And on the back of it, just so you guys can see, you do have their website and their support email as well as their phone number. So none of this trying to figure out how to contact them if something is not working. It's all right there. And we get a FT4 Pro Fast Talk 4 Riders Bluetooth. What is this? Oh, it's a nice quick manual. Now, I said this when I talked about the original FT4s and the B4 FMs, I believe they were. They come with one of these. And my recommendation was if you have a saddlebag or a tank bag or something, take this and throw it in there. Because Sometimes you're riding and you're pairing with somebody new or you're like, oh, I can't remember how to do something. This is like your quick reference guide, as you can see here. It just tells you exactly how to do all the features, how to set up the comms to two people, to three people, to four people, how to connect to your mobile phone, how to get information from your GPS, music, radio, all that kind of stuff. So you don't need to bring the big manual with you. That can stay at home in the box. But bring this, bring this with you, put it, put it in your bag. Right, this is gonna go in my, my tail bag. So I think that's excellent. Last but not least, all the goodies. And because this is a dual pack, everything is coming twice. So we have a couple things here. We have our mounts. So you get a mount here, depending on how you wanna mount it. You do have a 3M sticky version. So you can stick it on your helmet like this, or you have another version that is going to clamp onto your helmet. So you're gonna use screws. And they included, they included an Allen key wrench. That's good on you again. That one's going to fasten probably a little tighter or more secure, but depending on the position, you may want it up higher. I don't, it's, you know, it's up to you. And depending on your helmet type, maybe you don't want that. I get it. Inside here, you're going to have, oh, they all, they do feel, I have to say, even the speakers, maybe it's just me. Inside the package, they look like they're thicker. And maybe that's where you're going to get some of that bonus audio. Now, the other thing that's important here too, which is kind of cool, is you do get two kind of mics. You get a full boom microphone and you get, I want to say it's just a microphone. It's kind of floppy. There's no boom arm. So you can take that and if you have a full face, for instance, you can just kind of stick it into here, into your inside of your helmet. So right in there and you don't need this big boom arm. But if you're running a modular or a three quarter or a other kind of helmet, whatever you got that doesn't have the full face, then the boom arm is gonna be your preference. I get it, that's that's cool. That's all of it in there. This video is pretty long already. So I may break this down in two. I mean, two, four, two, two. I may break this down into two. And we are going to, well, I'm gonna put this all back so I don't lose any parts. So let's scoop, I wonder if there's any power in here. No, I'm not gonna turn it on. We're going to, do a second video that's shorter and I'm gonna install a set, not both, a set in my helmet. That video is gonna come up soon. I'm gonna do this hopefully this weekend and I'm gonna take a listen to the sound. I'm gonna listen to the sound compared to the old FT4s to see how much better they sound and to see how that flashlight works. All right guys, Lexan FT4 Pros, they're on the market. You can get them. Right now it looks like you have to get them from Lexan can't see them anywhere on like Amazon or anything like that. But once they arrive there, I will let you know and make sure that I put links down below for you guys. So if you want to go pick them up on Amazon, if not, I will put a link to Lexan's site down below. And uh, that's it. That's it. We're good. I'm excited to try these again. I've been, I've been rocking the FT4s and super good. Now I'm going to the pros cause Hey pro. All right guys. Link down below if you're interested to go take a look at the Lexan gear as well as this pro version and all their other stuff because their stuff's pretty good. And I'm going to leave you there. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Later, my friends.